Now on your feet at four, three news obtained body camera video of that massive brawl that took place outside. Look at this. This is outside Cleveland Heights High School Tuesday night. We've been talking about this, but now we're seeing it. The fight started after a boys basketball game. Neil Fisher, Fisher has been covering this story. He's in Cleveland Heights with the very latest. He has seen the video. Neil, what stood out to you? Hey, good afternoon, Christy. I think the first thing is that those two original officers that arrived at the scene of that fight called for backup almost immediately. We know that four agencies responded. This after seeing a few dozen people start fighting. 50 is what they reported seeing fight. We know that two officers were punched in the face, and although they weren't seriously injured, it raised concerns that this happened after a high school basketball game with teenagers involved. Take a listen to one of the police officers shortly after he was assaulted. Are you kidding me? Come here. This kid running across the theater just punched me in the face. Blackjack. The Cleveland Heights police chief told us last night that no one has been arrested in, to, in connection with the fight and that two 19-year-old men had to be treated for their injuries because of the fight. We did reach out to Cleveland Heights High School to see if they had anything that they were going to do with their game tomorrow night against Maple Heights. That is at Cleveland Heights. We haven't heard anything back right now about their plans for safety measures moving forward. Christy. All right, Neil, we appreciate it. Thank you so much.